Hello everyone, it's me Ryan here on the Ghost Layers Report as always. Now, despite the uh, crappy weather today and my um, hardcore chap lips, here we are again. Okay, so, looks like um, the Libertarian's favorite, Ron Paul, has kind of angered the uh, Republican Party here a little bit with some recent statements um, he made on Twitter regarding the death of Chris Kyle. Chris Kyle was an ex-Marine who was a uh, murdered at a gun range by a fellow um, service member as they, as they were, um, as they call it, treating uh, PTSD, I'll be that, I believe that's what it's called. Basically, it's a disorder where, like, um, if you experience something really extreme, uh, later on down the road, you'll, have, you'll be affected by it much more harshly than you were when it actually happened. It's a lot of military personnel suffer from this. And um, Ron Paul said, basically, that... Um, Treating uh, PTSD at a firing range or guns is not the best thing to do. I agree with him. I mean, if you're having that type of a uh, problem, the last thing you need to be is around guns. And the last thing you need to do is bring your friends who are also suffering from the same thing to a gun range to uh, as treatment, as therapy. Not a good idea at all. Now, I can see why the Republican Party is getting all up in arms about this, because typically they kind of ignore Ron Paul, even when he was in Congress and a member of their party. They're making a big thing about this right now because America is also having a huge gun debate. In light of uh, some of the tragic events that happened in America involving shootings at schools in 2012. So right now the Republican Party is on the warpath because they clearly don't want to have this conversation in America. They clearly don't want to talk about gun control at all. And anyone who comes out with any type of like criticism of guns, well, they're going to jump all over it. So the GOP is being ridiculous, guys. Completely ridiculous by jumping on Ron Paul this time. Okay? Now, a lot of times Ron Paul does deserve, does deserve criticism. Okay? Because a lot of his beliefs, yeah, are not all that practical. But he has good ideas all the same. And in the past, I've supported many things Ron Paul said, even though you know, I'm not really a libertarian. And I don't really follow their uh, ideology. But yeah, this time, Ron Paul is right on the money, GOP. And this is coming <laughs> from a leftist.